Oh, got a question for you. Mm -hmm. You started out a flavor unit. What made you mm -hmm. branch out from flavor unit and start Family Tree? So I started Family Tree while I was at Flavor Unit because Shaquem was giving me a piece of commission off of each artist I managed. So instead of me getting taxed, that's when I first kind of really learned I needed to create LLC. So I created Family Tree as my LLC. Um, but what eventually led to me leaving, what got me to come to Flavor Unit was Shaquem told me, you're never going to get rich working for other people. He was When he was talking to me about it, he was meant, you're never going to get rich being out here on the road for these people. You're just going to keep getting salaries and stuff like that. But if you come work for me, you can get a salary and commission. That's how you, you, you'll get rich. So that's why I went. I was like, oh, okay. And I was good. I was $3,500 a week. When, by the time I shot Kim and them came down, I was $400 a week when I started with Jodeci. By the time shot Kim and them came and got me, I was $3,500 a week for me to be out on the road with you and doing security road management, whatever. And that was great money for me at the time. I ain't yeah. know, I'm 24. Like, I'm every place. We living a good life. So when he said that, it made sense. So that's why I went to work for Flavor Unit. Three years later, when it was time for, when, when we started getting really big and a lot was going on, we kind of disagreed what that 5% was. As the checks got bigger, as we got hotter, um, <laughs> there was some, the negotiations on how much 5% looked different too. Like my 5% didn't look big when it was $1,500 out of a $5 check and stuff like that. But when it was $50,000 out of a, a check, it was like, oh, well, I meant 5%. It was just, you, you outgrow a company where I'm never going to get rich working for someone else, which means I'm never going to get rich working for you and Dana. This is, Fla this is Flavian. This is you and Dana's company. So no matter how much I bring in with the nine artists that I'm managing over here, you guys still going to take the bulk of that check. So it just made sense that it was time for me to go do the work and me get a bulk of the check. And Amicable had a conversation with Shaq Kim. Cool. It was, there was no fighting. There was nothing. Let me take, he let me take Outkast. Um, I think I took Outkast, like Daniel Jones, like a couple artists that I had been doing anyway. Um, and broke out. Okay, you just told me something I didn't know. Mm -hmm. I didn't realize Outkast was originally signed to to Flavor Unit. Yes, that was. So the story goes: 1994, Queen Latifah Dana runs into Dallas Austin. Dallas Austin gives her a tape on Monica Arnold. Dana falls in love with Monica, thinks she's the greatest thing, tells me and Shaquem to go get Monica for management. We fly to Atlanta to meet with Monica, her parents, Dallas, the whole nine. We get Monica, wrap that up. Before we leave, Shaquem's like, yo, let's go by the face, say what's up to LA and them. Just like kind of, we in your town, courteous, the whole thing. We go, LA is telling us about a group that he has called Outcast that he had put a record on his Christmas album and it was starting to go. Um, and it was funny. Shaquem wanted to get in business with LA who seemed to have this, all this talent in the South that was going. And LA wanted to get business with, in business with Shaquem because he had a group like Outkast and he'd seen what Shaquem had done in hip hop with Naughty by Nature and that. So the original relationship was formed between Shaquem and LA. I got handed to do the work. And so I was like, Cool. I don't think, to be honest, looking back, either of them ever really understood what it could have been. Really, at the end of the day, it was a relationship builder for the two of them. And it wasn't like either of them were really like, this is going to become what Outcast became. That was on me. So I took on Outcast because Shaquem and Chris Lighty were my idols, and they had Tribe Called Quest, and they had Naughty by Nature. So I... Outcast was going to be my chance to, like, from the beginning, like, I came in on the Fushnikers. Mm -hmm. So I, I inherited and was working the Fushnikers differently than Outcast, who I got in and was able to, and like, it was my group. There was no things about it, and I was able to rock and roll. So, yeah, we started with Flavor Unit. I, on one trip to Atlanta, I got Monica and Outcast for management, and that's kind of where the rise began. What's up guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. 
you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.